So it's, it's, it's one thing I'm out there. And one thing I'm out there when it comes down to the youth right now is the minds. If I can change their lives, they can. The only way to change your life, you got to change your mind. That's the only way. If we, if we can get them to start thinking a different way, um, send their mind somewhere else besides this right here, this going to kill them. The biggest drug on the world that, that, that you don't even got to take everybody on it right now. That's right. Everybody on this drug right here, this drug right here is killing everybody. This drug will get you killed. This drug can get you get you money. Uh, this drug will mess you off. And this drug right here, they give it to the kids too. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Try to make a change. Thank you. Um, uh, OG person. I got one. I just, yeah, I want to uh, ask you that same okay. question. I want to ask you in a way to where the area that you affect, the people that you're around, because mm -hmm. he's coming from a California right. standpoint. Right. You here in it. Texas. And and what he said really it. it involves around government, period. But yeah. what what would what would you do to help influence uh the youth and uh, our people from going into those situations? It's only it's it's, it's one thing I'm out the and one thing I'm out the when it comes down to the youth right now is the minds. If I can change their lives, they can the only way to change your life, you gotta change your mind. That's the only way. If we if we can get them to start thinking a different way, um, send their mind somewhere else besides this right here, this gonna kill them. The biggest drug on the world that, that, that you don't even gotta take everybody on it right now. That's right. Everybody on this drug right here, this drug right here is killing everybody. This drug will get you killed. This drug can get you get you money. Uh, this drug will mess you off. And this drug right here, they give it to the kids too. The kids got the same drug right here. They walk around with it every day in their pocket. You dig what I'm saying? This right here is the mind changer. This whatever whatever you look at is what's on your mind. The only way to get the youth back is to change their minds. The only way to change your life, you have to change your mind. They don't. This is a bad drug. If you need rehabilitation, get them back down to um um digging gardens. Get back to that handwork. Everything yeah. started off telephone and tell a Negro. That's, how, that's, <laughs> that's the go. quickest way, man. Okay, that's that's that, how that, me, to me. I'm gonna come uh, to you, Mayhem. What yeah. do you? <laughs> how, can, how can we help to to, to to our our youth, our people, from going into those conditions? Man, I feel again. One thing that I see that we need to do, I want to be able to support and pay people like OG Percy, Melvin, Supreme. All, I, might, I want to pay these guys, overcompensate them, hundreds of thousands of dollars a year. Use these guys as youth mentors to go back into the hood. These guys are the perfect examples of who needs to go back. Ain't nobody better than one of us to go back in there. We don't want nobody going back front and talking to these kids mm -hmm. about something they don't know. Now, we don't have to necessarily do everything, but we want to be a facilitator. I want to get these guys and pay them and show the world. My job is to show the world why these guys are priceless, right? We come out of prison. And I tell people that all the time, man, and one thing that I have a burning desire, one thing I ain't got to explain, I, I know these guys, we know why, what we need to do, and we know why we need to do it. I ain't got to explain to these guys why they need to tell these kids why to stay out of prison. See, because if, if I can't talk to him, he can. If he can't talk to him, he can. not But we don't have nobody who really will support these guys because they're going to look at him and they're going to judge him by his past and they're going to question his ability. They're going to question his character. But instead, it says you need to back him. You need to support him financially. You need to enable these people because the kids really, the behind closed doors, this is who they look up to. This is who they listen to. And I tell people all the time, what really makes you an OG? When you have somebody following you, and you already know people follow me. Mm. I, don't have, I, don't, I don't pay nobody to call me no OG. Mm -hmm. I don't ask nobody to call me no OG. No, none of that. They do that out, out, of, out of honor and the pre, but they do that because they watch me and they see that. And what I try to do is try to limit my talk and show them by action. But 50% of what I do is talk good. The other 50% of what I do is back up what I say, or at least do everything I can to do that. You feel me? So what I'm trying to do is to show everybody that I know that just because I've been in prison. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.